Hello everyone. Today we will discuss 10 attitudes we should maintain when we are going through trials from God. Even in times of suffering we must follow God's will and live with the right attitude. Let's explore these attitudes one by one. First, maintain faith. It is crucial to keep your faith in God during times of trial. Hebrews 11.1 1 says, Now faith is confidence in what we hope for and assurance about what we do not see. Through faith, we firmly believe in God's promises and trust His guidance. Faith is a powerful tool to overcome hardships, reminding us that God is always with us and never abandons us. Second, maintain a prayerful life. Even during trials, we must pray to God and seek His help. Philippians 4.6 says, Do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your requests to God. Prayer strengthens our soul and allows us to experience God's comfort and peace. By praying, we can entrust our worries and fears to God and receive His peace. Third, maintain a grateful heart. It is important to keep a heart of gratitude even in times of suffering. 1 Thessalonians 5.18 says, Give thanks in all circumstances, for this is God's will for you in Christ Jesus. Through gratitude, we can recognize the small blessings God has given us and praise His goodness. A grateful heart shifts our focus from suffering to God, allowing us to appreciate His grace more deeply. Fourth, maintain patience and endurance. Patience and endurance are necessary during times of trial. James 1, 3-4 says, because you know that the testing of your faith produces perseverance. Let perseverance finish its work so that you may be mature and complete, not lacking anything. Through patience, we mature and draw closer to God, understanding that trials help us grow stronger in faith. Fifth, seek God's will. We must seek God's will even during suffering. Romans 12, 2 says, do not conform to the pattern of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Then you will be able to test and approve what God's will is, His good, pleasing, and perfect will. Seeking God's will and following His guidance is essential, especially during tough times. Sixth, maintain a forgiving heart. We should have a forgiving heart towards those who cause us suffering. Matthew 6, 14, 15 says, for if you forgive other people when they sin against you, your heavenly Father will also forgive you. But if you do not forgive others their sins, your Father will not forgive your sins. Forgiveness brings us peace and restores our relationship with God. Seventh, maintain hope. Even in suffering, we must not lose hope. Romans 5, 3, 4 says, Not only so, but we also glory in our sufferings, because we know that suffering produces perseverance perseverance, character, and character, hope. Hope drives us forward and allows us to anticipate God's salvation. It helps us overcome hardships by trusting in God's promises. Eighth, maintain humility. We must maintain a humble heart, even in times of suffering. 1 Peter 5, 6 says, Humble yourselves, therefore, under God's mighty hand, that He may lift you up in due time. Humility is the path to receiving God's grace, acknowledging His sovereignty, and submitting to His will. Ninth, help others. Even during trials, we should maintain an attitude of helping others. Galatians 6.2 says, Carry each other's burdens, and in this way, you will fulfill the law of Christ. Helping others is pleasing to God and a practical way to live out our faith, even in the midst of our own struggles. Tenth, Meditate on God's Word. We must meditate on God's Word and seek His wisdom even during suffering. Psalm 119.105 says, Your Word is a lamp for my feet, a light on my path. God's Word provides us with comfort and wisdom. Through it, we can understand His will more clearly and receive His guidance. All these attitudes are crucial for us to maintain during times of trial from God. By practicing these attitudes, we can follow God's will and live a life that glorifies Him, even in suffering. Let us pray. God, thank you for teaching us the important attitudes to maintain during times of trial. 
Help us to align our lives with your will and live for your glory. Let us not lose faith during hardships and come to you with prayer and gratitude. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. If this video blessed you,